Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel, girl, child, girl, I am Tanya, girl, I am a thrift queen, lover of all the things, girl, if you're into thrift and fashion, home decor, girl, a little bit of gardening, okay, subscribe to the vibe, so this week, we're just getting into the video, a lot of different little things going on in the video, let me know in the comments if you guys enjoy videos like this, I love you guys, let's just get this video going. All right, y'all, so I popped over into Ollie's because my girl over on TikTok has been helping me try to figure out what I need to do in my garden. So one of the things that she recommended is that um, I get a climbing rose to go over um, one of the walls in the very front on the um, left side of my house. So I came into Ollie's because I was looking for, she told me that they have really good deals or prices on flower pots. So I've never been in Ollie's before. I've never, this store kind of gives me um, it sort of reminds me of if you have like an at home, it reminds me kind of sort of of what at home gives with all like the home decor stuff, um, a bunch of different things in here from the, you know, rugs, girl, you can find pots in here, girl, you can find um, clothes up in here. I was over in the book section, which I'll show you that in a second. Like I was just completely shocked because I've never been in a Ollie's before, girl, the guy duped me at the register because, girl, he asked me, you know, for the sign up for their little stuff. And, girl, I can't I can't stand signing up for these news things that are emails that come from these um, businesses because, girl, they flood you. They, they, they flood the email. The email get flooded out, okay? So here I am over where the flower pots, I finally found where they were. Um, and she recommended that I get something that was super tall. That way it gives some height to whatever I decide to go with. Now, I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to go with a climbing rose. I've been thinking about doing a star jasmine. I hear people talk about that Katrina rose. I think it's the Peggy Martin Katrina rose. And if you haven't um, heard about that rose, just Google it, girl. The story behind it was super neat. Um, obviously, dealing with Hurricane Katrina. But either that or some type of climbing rose. Now, she did recommend that I do like, um, she said any color would pop. But of course, she said on my brick on my house, I probably want to get like a white climbing rose. So I'm going to be on the hunt for a white climbing rose that I can add to the garden. But um, they didn't have any tall um, planters in here this particular day. But I still was shocked at what they did have. And then, girl, I ended up going over here to the book section. And I didn't even realize they had all this going on. I don't think at home has books but i was very shocked at the book selection not only that but also the prices of the books and they got books kind of sort of in every single category almost set up like girl of barnes and noble books a million type of situation but you know if you're in the look for anything kind of home anything you know random <laughs> i would definitely recommend going up in an Ollie's, especially if you have an Ollie's um, in your area. Now, I, as I'm thinking about it, this store also reminds me of when we used to have um, Dirt Cheap. And so our Dirt Cheap was sort of kind of set up like this. Matter of fact, this really reminds me of Dirt Cheap because I think Dirt Cheap also has like books and various different things. Although this store was very organized, um, I was shocked at how organized this place was when I went in there. But um, I did end up finding a couple of books um, out of here, especially some, um, food type books. Um, and I'll show y'all that in a second, but go up in Ollie's child girl. Yeah. This won't be the last time that I go in here. Um, I definitely gonna have to bring my mom up in this store. Cause I'm sure that she would probably absolutely love, um, Ollie's. So I bounced my way back around to the book section and then they have also the Chrissy Teigen books. If you're a Magnolia, if you like, um, them you their books are there now this book was one that my leak had recommended like a while ago she um actually um did i guess like a partnership with terry of no crumbs left if you don't follow her on instagram go check it out but girl i grabbed three books a barefoot contessa girl a piece of martha stewart grilling and then girl i bounced on out of ollie's but right next to my ollie's is an old time pottery now i don't know if you all have old time pottery in your area but again this is another warehouse to me type store so i definitely bounced on over here because i did know that they also have um flower pots and different type of outdoor things so again this one still reminds me a little bit of like at home with all the different products in this store so or big lots i guess maybe if some of you all have big lots in your area 
So I finally figured out where the pots were. So I bounced on over around here and they have a huge selection of pots. Um, I did see a few that I'm probably going to go back and grab. But again, if you have an old time pottery, definitely go check out old time pottery. Because as you can see, girl, they have a lot of things. Now, this pot right here was one option. I do like the color of this one. She did recommend I either get a black pot, but she also said that I could probably go with a burgundy. So, y'all, they have some pots outside. Those, this one's not bad. Although it's got like a little crack in it. I don't know how much it is. It doesn't say, but it's a gray planter. Then I saw that gray one giving me like a concrete situation and then they had a really huge blue one those are cute like little terracotta kind of like this little urn situation cute and then i have this big blue one so i'm not sure which one i'm gonna go with but they also had this blue in front of my flower beds So yeah, y'all, I'm out here trying to figure out this potting situation after work, going to the gym. But yeah. So if you have an Ollie's, come check out Ollie's because they do have some options for you. I like these little things. I kind of wanted to do like a Mediterranean garden vibe in the back of my, on my patio. So I kind of like some of these. Especially that one. What are these? Fire pits? What are these? Now, there was a guy in the store who had picked up like five of these wind chimes. So, girl, in the spirit of I'm copying, girl, I ended up grabbing me one. I said I was going to go back and get one for my mom for Mother's Day, but I really love this. And then this flower pot was another one that I saw, especially on my back patio. If I wanted to go with like a Mediterranean vibe, I thought that one was really, really nice. All right, y'all, so it's been a minute since I've been in the Play-Dohs, but actually, girl, I was coming in here to try to find me some Adidas Sambas because I passed on them before. But these Steve Maddens were super cute. Y'all already know I'm drawn to orange, but I didn't end up getting those. Now, they had these pants from Zara. Super, super cute. I'm going to do um, a little try-on video just of me um, trying on a couple of pieces that I did grab, but I absolutely love these pants. The fit on them was super good. Y'all already know I live for me a piece of pattern pants, so I ended up grabbing those, and then they also had these Zara, um, pants in the store as well. Definitely love the color, love the pattern on them. So, girl, I definitely had to grab <laughs> these pants, and then I also saw these, um, mules, these Public Desire. I love the cow print on these, so, Girl, I picked them up too. All right, y'all. So I wanted to come on and just share um, the pieces that I did get from Plato's Closet that you just saw me show you guys. So this was the dress. Now, this dress is super cute, super girly, flirty. I love the lace and detail on it. Real cute. Hopefully, you can tell. Real cute. But yeah, so this will be perfect for like a brunch. It'd be perfect for a bridal, a cute little tea party. I love it. Super flirty, girly. I just have on gold accessories with this. Um, but you know, you can dress this up, dress it down. You can go with a like a all nude look if you wanted to just do nude with it. Super bomb. I love it. Definitely a piece that will be in rotation and it's light enough that I could probably wear this, you know, during the summertime, especially in the evening. Um, a super cute, real cute dress. I love this. Let me know what y'all think. But she real cute, <laughs> at least to me. <laughs> All right, y'all. So here are the jeans. Um, these are from Fashion Nova. And then the top is also a Fashion Nova top. Super cute. Um, and I just threw on my little red cherry earrings. Girl, this is giving me freedom. Okay, it's giving me red, white, and blue 4th of July, right? But super cute. I really love the jeans. Um, you probably can't even really see the back. Girl, it's giving a little under boob. Okay. Super cute. I don't think, I don't know if you could see. Oh, there go. The back of the top. Super cute. The jeans do kind of gap just a little bit in the back on me but super cute nonetheless and i just put on some red heels to kind of bring in the red from my earrings but yeah super cute i really love this little look could be perfect um for the summertime but 
the jeans, yes. And I love the color of these jeans. I love the denim wash of these, but super cute. Really love this look. All right, y'all. So I just kept on the same um, top and the earrings just so I can show y'all um, these pants that came from Zara. Super cute on. I'm kind of standing on my tippy toes just to kind of raise them because they are super long, but real cute. I even look, like it with the denim. I'm not quite sure how I would style this. Maybe just a regular tee or a different tee with the color in it. Probably wouldn't do my little cherry earrings, but I just left them on just to show you guys the pants. Super cute. Again, Play-Doh's Closet for the win. I definitely love going in there, especially like for Zara pieces. I can find Pretty Little Thing, Urban Outfitters. So if you're not into thrifting and thrifting ain't your vibe, girl, go to Play-Doh's if you want to shop um, secondhand and you know you ain't dealing with the thrift vibes or the thrift smells and all of that. Girl, just go to Play-Doh's. But these pants are super cute. Really love them. All right, y'all. So here are the other Zara pants that I grabbed. Love these too. I think I remember when these hit the website, but super cute. I love the pattern. I can't tell if this color is really like a blue or if it's like a purple, but I'm going to go with blue. I kept on the same top, girl, same earrings, just so I could show you guys what the pants look like on. These are really cute. They fit just a little bit better than the other ones in terms of the waist. Uh, I think these were like a size 12. I think those are a 12 too. Y'all know how Zara can be girl running small and everything else but these are super cute love these pants and of course the top but super cute check out play those all right y'all so i just wanted to pop in and show you um a couple of things that i just got in from amazon the first thing that i got was this um fan because child girl i'm going on vacation and um, June next month and so you know the girl has got to have the fans because where I'm going is hot and warm so I grabbed the fan um, I've been well for those of you who don't know um, I used to live in Korea and girl Korean skincare I'm already hip to the game but um, my girl over on TikTok um, Alexis Cartagena she posted um, that she uses this skincare um, for her skin and she absolutely loved it and I saw it on Amazon and it was on sale because originally girl this was a hundred dollars so I ended up grabbing this for I think it was like 50 something the other day so I'm excited um I'm gonna try this tonight um just to check it out and then I also I already have these links these are some um pants that I plan to take on vacation um I think Kyra had shared these Kyra I'm unique here on YouTube she shared these on her vacation to Thailand, I want to say. One of her vlogs, vacation vlogs. And so um, I'm kind of going with neutrals for my trip. So I grabbed these. So I'm going to try those on and see if I like them. But here are just some quick little goodies that I grabbed from Amazon. All right, y'all, so I'm back home now. Just got in from Kroger. Girl, I went by the taco truck, got me some tacos. So I'm just on the couch. I really want to get a nap, but I'm, I'm having a live sale tonight. So I need to get the rack um, set up and everything on my website. I was sitting here, girl, because I've been watching Jerenica. Girl, just catching the vibes. Um, but I've been to the gym today. Um, I really didn't have much that I was planning to do today. I did say that I was going to have a live sale, so that'll be coming. It's so interesting, the ray of light from over there. <laughs> but I'm just on the couch, you guys. Saturday, and I'm tired. But let's go, because I got things to do. 1 p.m. I went for a walk this morning with my grandma at 9 a.m. She picked me up at 9 a.m. She just dropped me off at 341. All right, y'all. So I'm in my closet room. I'm about to get ready to get this rack together. I'm still watching Jeronica. The rack is already up. I just have to tag everything and get it all up on the website. I'm probably going to add some more pieces to it just because that was the stuff that was just in the room that I just had scattered, girl. 
So yeah, um, because I haven't been on live in so long, there's a mix of all seasons on the rack. But that's just how it is for me. Y'all already know I shop off seasons anyway. I don't, you know, if I see a mink at the thrift store, girl, I'm about the mink. Okay. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, the seasons. I'm gonna get everything. So, um, but yeah, the room is picked up. You know, I still have a couple of bags that I just recently thrifted, and that was my Play-Dohs um item. So they're just hanging out over there. Um, I still have yet to change my closet. Um and I guess because this is like the things that are like my favorite thrift items that I find. So this closet is really mostly all thrifted things, um, except for like the bags. So my bags are bags that I have, you know, purchased, say Zara, different websites, shades, of course, Amazon, shoes, you know, I purchased them various places. But a majority of it is, um, a majority of it is um, thrifted, so... But um, normally, typically, I know some people rotate their closets every season. I just don't. I mean, it's just tops, blazers, skirts, dresses, you know, belts, jewelry, scarves, shoes, jeans, tees. Uh, I just, I don't change it out. I just leave it how it is. But so right now I'm about to get ready to tag the items and get things ready for a live tonight. y'all so the rack is together as you can see i've got the numbers all on everything and so right now what i'm about to do is go through write everything down on a, my piece of paper that way i can um transfer the information from my paper to the laptop so sorry for my ghetto fan y'all can hear in the background but that is how i start to get the rack together for a live sale all right, y'all. So I was going to add the clip of me going live and I recorded it on my, my other camera. I can't get the file off <laughs> my SD card to my phone. I get, I've cleaned out my phone, deleted old videos, deleted pictures. I've done the whole night. Can't get it off. That's what's been postponing the video on Sunday, even though Sunday was my birthday. So I wasn't, you know, I should have just said that I wasn't going to post on Sunday. But girl, I'm irritated because I want that footage and I can't get it off the SD card. And it was like 20 minutes. I definitely didn't mean to record that long, but I had forgot that I was recording. And so by the time I realized it, it was 20 minutes long. And so I can't get that footage off. So I'm just going to close out the video. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Catch you on the next video, girl.